Hello, I'm Foibles and welcome to another episode of Pampered Pope in Europa Universalis 4. Um, we are still in the middle of this shitty war I kind of got us into. Oops. Um, I still think we can somehow do something here. We can slow France down at least. Although it's going to be really expensive for us. Um, they are going to come here then, are they? In the 15th day. Um, let's build some mercenaries. Like here. Condotta, Con Landschnecten. Landschnecten. Condotta infantry. And a Landschnecten here. And let's hope we get enough peoples to do something. And I think we'll win this fight hands down. Um, because France was stupid enough to actually come here and fight us. Um, I think Lorraine, Lorraine is, is being stupid, they are trying to siege us. Um, is there a river crossing between that and Avignon? Yes, there is. Damn you. That stinks. Um, let's send our mercenary infantry over here. And let's hope this will... No, that will not. Oh, you, sh you shitty France. Oh, yay. Beautiful. You people just run away. And in the meantime, I guess we'll go take care of this. And our leader has died, has he not? Yes, he has. Whatever. We need some, we need a decent leader, and you seem to be the best, so we'll go with you. Too bad, our amazing leader has died. We need to score some wins here. Let's hope we can get to Avignon before they can get here, and let's retreat to Dauphin, and hopefully we can... I don't really matter. I don't really mind if they come to Dauphin to fight us in the mountains. Um, let's. Yeah, they did come here, and we are winning. I think this battle. Yes, we did win. Beautiful. That's just beautiful. Also, we should um, bump down the speed because speed four is a bit too fast for for this kind of a war let's see France is well their enthusiasm enthusiasm is high and we have a ton of a crap ton of um, uh, war exhaustion and this is just going to be this is going to be ugly Let's see if we can go and snipe this army here. Probably not. Um, I'd really like to go and kill... Kill this army. Um, where is the river crossings? Is there any place we can avoid it? Not really, no. There's river crushing no matter what way we go. So let's just pound bounce on it then. We have to take some of these nasty fights even. Um, hopefully we can... Um, let's see... How is it going? We are losing it. And that world is kind of bad, so let's retreat. For now, let's take a moral moral tick uh, like so, and let's come back into the fight. And there is a rebellion. That's just great. And now we have more morale, and we can do some damage to the French army. Although they are coming to reinforce with force. So now it's a good time to retreat again. 
I know we did take some losses with that and actually we do have to go take care of the those pesky rebels. Sadly. Um, so let's go do that first. And we'll deal with the French after that. You stupid peasants. You just never know when to quit, do you? Let's build some mercenaries because we have money. And I don't want to use too much of our manpower fighting other people's wars. Which we are basically doing right now. All of our own infantry has been destroyed pretty much in this war, so that's always something to consider. But it is what it is. Um, that's a bit silly to attack so soon, I guess. Should have waited for morale and then go beat up these rebels. But it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Um, let's build a, another condotta, and probably we have to take some loans. Loans, I think, is better to take rather than take uh, lose all of your manpower in a war. It's fine, it's fine. Let's consolidate again. And France is... They have, um, yeah, they are going to win this war pretty badly, even. But hopefully we can make a dent to them, so that would be good. Um, we don't really want to be in this war for very much longer. Um, it was a mistake to join this war in the first place. So let's see, what do you want? You don't want anything. Suggest demands. What? would you want from us well that's bit that's a bit too much man not going to happen I can concede defeat but that's about it in that case we are not going to go away we are not going to be going away that's just not going to happen man I'll come fight you again um, in somewhere else, but not the mountains. I know we are um, um, we are suffering attrition on our own land, but let's see if there is some easy pickings here. And there is this army that we can go and deal with fairly easily, most likely. Uh, we, I should have probably used forced for, forced march. Are you coming here? Actually, in that case, I guess I'll go to Dauphin. I don't really want to fight all of that on my own. Not right now, anyway. And I guess I will send half of the army to here. So we won't um, get so much attrition. We won't suffer so much attrition. Hopefully we get there before the month ticks. Um, we did not, sadly. Oh well, um, we can put the secondary leader in charge of this army, and I guess we'll just wait and see for now what they are going to do. Um, this army has too many um, cannons, so I guess I'll, I'll recruit some more, some more um, um, mercenary infantry. And maybe we should go beat up on this army here, although they have a second army right over there. Um, although we could siege this town too, it's pretty quick siege. Quick siege to take care of that. Um, can we get there in time? Probably not. Yeah, no way. So that's something. But let's siege this down at least since we are pretty close to sieging it down. Well, not really, but we have a ton of cannon here. We have brought enough cannon to conquer hell, is what Henry VIII said in his campaign of Bologna. Interesting, interesting stuff. Just, just watched, I've been watching some historical TV series and 
Tudors is the Tudors is absolutely one of my all times favorite. Um, it's a really good TV series. Should you should watch it if you're into that kind of stuff. The Borgias and the Tudors they are both really good in that genre. And let the time tick by. De -de 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 -de. Um, let's do that. There is no one, no real, real military guy I really want. I think I would really like to go beat up this army. I guess I could do this. Send these over here. Um, you should come from there though. To avoid attrition. What are you doing? Yeah, like so. And now let's go beat up on this army. I guess we could go beat up on that one too. Silly France pulled his army away. Let's go take this one. It's time to die, France. Oh, there is their main stack. Hopefully we can kill this one before they can reinforce. And indeed we did. At least did some major damage to it. They are going to be here on 5th of August. I don't know if we can get away, probably not, but we can get a moral tick. Um, I don't know if um, attacking that is very wise right now. Not with the full... Oh, but, but, but... They are coming here. Let's let them do that then. Um, hopefully we can get there in time. Can we know? No, oh, damn it. Oh well. Oh shit. Uh, we have a abundance of diplomatic power. So I guess it's fine to use them. Hopefully we can get away. We cannot. So I guess we'll just send the... Um, everything we have. And build some mercenaries here. In hopes of prolonging this battle enough to um, maybe retreat. Well, it's a good fight, so I don't really want to retreat. Um, they have two penalty. Um, when are you going to get there? The very first day. Um, although they are really, really punishing us. So, yeah, let's retreat. Kind of a bad fight for us in. Good, you shouldn't be in that coalition, I'm telling you. And let's build some more mercenaries then. Here-ish. Hopefully that Dauphin one falls soon. And Venice is down there. Silly Venice. Let's send all of these over there. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Most of these are just mercenaries that are trying to reinforce, so I'm going to consolidate consolidate it and just build the mercenaries. Rebuild them over here. Um, and hopefully we can get Dauphin. And hopefully maybe we can kill some armies over here. At the very least, I think we will go and try to help them siege this down. Um, you on there on the 23rd day. And what is this? This is Roos. And there is a river crossing. So, that's something to consider. And also, in, while we are doing these defensive sieges on a lands of an allied person, we won't get um, 
we won't get at we won't suffer any attrition so that's good and we have had that expensive at, um, expensive um, admin advisor on all the time but I think that's fine how is tech yeah, we are so behind on tech. Um, I think we'll take the religious ideas now, though. Let's just take it. Let's get it over with. We are the Pope, we are supposed to take that, I guess. Um, I don't really care too much. Oh, fine. Fine, fine. I guess I could send some more of these cannons over there to help with the siege of Berikrod. How much do you have? You have only that many. So let's build some more mercenaries. Landschnechten infantry, Konjota infantry. And that should be fine. We are most likely going to be able to take this back quite handily. And they are going to limousine. Let's see if we can reinforce it quickly enough. And you are there on... Alright then, they don't want to reinforce it. Ooh, they want to come into Perigord. Alright then. Come, by all means come. No? Alright then. I'm going to be sending all of my troops here then. Although Venice is trying to take Treviso, so that's kind of a problematic for us. And our war exhaustion is quite high, but we have an we have um, abundance of Diplo points, so we can just bite down some. It's fine. And you are trying to get there again. And so it happens. Let's see if we can reinforce it quickly enough. It seems like we can indeed. And let's actually send you there. And you can stay there. And that sh should be fine most likely. And let's send you there as well because and let's send even more because they are sending their main stack over there as well but we win the day the papal armies man they are a beast the army of the pope let's go kill this little stack from here and that gave us a ton of um, uh, what's it called war score I don't really know if I should believe the war score indicator on all things though um, let's send you over there and you over there let's get some more mercenaries You're really going to come and fight us then. On 8th of July. Then by all means do come. Come here. I'll give you a big hug. You will come on... Alright then. Let's do this. Four boatmen. Let's kill the French army. This is a costly, costly war, I must say, but beating on France is always fun. Kill the French. Although I must admit that they are putting a quite a fight. And now we should go and take care of this one. Well, actually not yet. 
Let's go to Armagnier. I think it has a higher supply limit than Toulon. Well, actually, they have the about the same. But let's take that moral tick, and now can we can go and destroy this army. Although they probably um, there is river crossing between pretty much everything, except Labour. So let's go there. Actually, there is a rear crossing from there too. So let's let's just do that then. Let's just go and beat them to hell from here. They don't have a leader, so this should be a pretty easy win. Like so. They won't get a siege out from that. Sadly, Venice takes Trebiso. Um and French troops are coming to Limousine on the 14th, so let's wait till 13th and then reinforce this fight. And hopefully we can decimate the French army again. And I think I think I'm about ready to get out from this war. Now, France. It's time to Time to do white bees. Um, you have a very low in enthusiasm. Although I guess we we could stay here. We could stay in this war for a bit longer. Siege maybe something like Labour. Yeah, why not? Or actually, let's do it like this. Um, let's leave half here and half will go to Poito. Although. Auvergne is... Um, oh, they peaced out. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Well, that that is fine. Because now I can dissolve this alliance and attack you myself. Yes. I don't want to be your friend anymore. And you don't have any... You don't have any um, alliances, so the next thing to do is to kill Guyenne. Only reason I did that was to prevent France from getting their stuff back, and so that we can instead be taking um, Guyenne and make them into our little bitch, so to speak. Well, I don't know if we are going to make that, but we are going to make something happen with them. I don't think it's um, it's way too big of a country to make them into a vassal, so it is what it is. But anyway, um, well, I am going to have to take a break here. Thank you for watching. Um, if you like the video, then please do click the like button and subscribe. It really helps out quite a lot with my new channel, and I would really appreciate it. Um, I hope you have a nice and good day. And I see you in the next video, hopefully. Bye-bye.